Hello everybody, this is the Minor Jack here to bring you another episode of Weapons of War. Um, in this one we have the automatic TNT cannon. It's it's a pretty good invention. I, l I like it a lot. It was a favorite, but I ended up purging my YouTube channel because all of them were 240p horrible audio. But now I render with video pad and I record with audacity, so everything's better. So now I can come back to showing you guys all the cool stuff. So as of most the inventions, this thing has a manual. And it has one of those things called an automatic. I don't know why I said it like that. Okay. But warning. I thought it wouldn't do anything if you press this button a couple times and put TNT in there. Eventually, it, a piece of TNT will get blown out. And it will destroy this. I've had it destroy itself about two times on it. So, so first, I'm going to go over the most complicated part, the clock. So in total, there's... I think it's... One second. Let me do some math here. 18 repeaters. There's 11 repeaters on the second tick, there's 5 repeaters on the fourth tick, and then there's 2 repeaters on the first one. You could experiment, but don't do it too much, because if you're letting TNT out here before the whole shot explodes, then eventually it'll start messing with everything. So I'm going to say that again in case anybody didn't get it. 11 on the second tick, 5 on the fourth, and 2 on the first. Okay, so now, see, here's manual. We press it. Boom and boom. With cannons, timing is always a secret. So I figured out the timing on this that you need for it to be. All you have to do is hit that button. But um, the timing for it to be perfect, where it'll it'll hit the ground right when it explodes. So that's really helpful. So it's one, two, three, four, five, five on full, and then the sixth one just at the first. And there you go. And see now, let's hit this automatic switch. See, so this is basically the fastest TNT cannon you'll be able to make. It's nice. I like it a lot. Boom, and you can... if you I think if you filled up every one of the dispensers with 64, it's somewhere... It's in the 900s range. That's 900 continuous shots where you don't have to do anything. So it frees you up if you want to build more cannons, if you want to go in there and fight them for yourselves. Whatever you honestly want to do. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Please remember to comment, rate, and subscribe. I will talk to all of you guys later. Obviously, check out my channel. There's other videos in other series, but there's also videos in this series that you can go take a look at. Um, I will talk to all of you guys later. Bye! So many explosions. So little time.